everybody, my name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Visually Blind in Hero Mode. Jeez, I can't, I still can't get over <laughs> how much that is to say. Um, in the last episode, we reunited two lovers in harmony or something, I don't freaking know. <laughs> Anyways, we did a whole bunch of windfall and stuff. Um, what else did we, oh yeah, we did the freaking Battleship minigame, that sucked. Uh, in this episode, we're actually gonna drink grandmother's soup. Whoa, we also got a freaking 11th heart in the last episode, too. Thank the Lord for that. Oh, yeah, we also got a third bottle, which is freaking fantastic. So, we're actually coming in here to go get some more grimy soup. Grandma, I don't mean to alarm you, but I'm just here to freaking use your soup. And by the way, the reason why I just don't get a bunch of soup. Like it's, it's like you'd imagine, why not just get more soup here? I th I'm pretty sure, unless it's been changed here, which could be very true, you can only get one bottle of soup at a time. Oh, Link, how are you? Have you ever yourself, have you? Run a grandma's homemade soup, you can just come see me. So, yeah, she only gives you one, well, I guess two helpings of it. Which is kind of annoying, but, um, what can you do? <laughs> so, because of that, we're actually gonna get more fairies, but to be honest, I kind of prefer that anyways. Well, for one, because it would be a little bit overpowered if you could get more than one bottle of grandma soup. And for two, I kind of like fairies better. I mean, they don't give as much hearts, but they help, they, they revive you if you die, which is a freaking huge help. I almost wonder if, oh, I was gonna say that, I didn't expect that to happen. Uh, I would honestly like, what would be even more of a crazy challenge is to do this game without fairies and just potions. Or maybe there's like no health items at all and never get hit once. That'd be crazy. Or maybe you can get hit just to give you some leeway. Just give you some extra leeway in the freaking world's most difficult challenge. Probably isn't that difficult. I mean, it's probably really difficult, but it's probably not crazy like impossible like I'm making it out to be. Oops. Oh. <laughs> I wanted to control myself using the D-pad there. Oh, come on, seriously game. No. No, I don't want that. I want fairies. Give me fairies! Yeah! Yay! You got a fairy in your bottle! Yeah. She's crying, but that's okay. She'll help me one day. I mean, she could clearly escape, though, because they come out when you die. And it's like, I don't think I'm able to pull out a fairy after I die. So, yeah. Um, sure. I'll just throw some random items in there, just so I don't actually use up my fairies. Because, let's face it, it's totally gonna happen. Alrighty! Oh, you know what I just realized? We should've came here first. Cause we need to go to outside island anyways. Oh, no we don't. Never mind, we were going to Windfall Island. Once again, there you go, mixing up my temples again. The other temple was the one that was by outside island. <laughs> oh, that looks really scary and painful. Well, maybe not painful, but, well, yeah, probably painful. <laughs> Be ripped around by the winds like that. That's pretty scary. Alrighty, we want to go north, right? Triforce, great. W something C, wonderful. Eight out of eight, mate. Alright, so we want to go more of this. I don't understand. Why is that? I think that's kind of glitching out a bit. I think it's like thinking about my normal sail. I'm even going slower than my normal sail, though. It's really weird. Did I? Okay, I did get the map fish here. Map fish, map fish. Map fish, map fish. Do 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 do. Alrighty. Oh, I don't understand why like there's day squares and night squares. Like for some places it makes sense, like Windfall Island and Outside Island, places that change from night to day. However, islands like this, I don't understand because there's 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 no difference between night and day here. So yeah, I don't know. It's weird to me. And I'm going slow again for some reason. Maybe just because I'm close to the island and I don't want you to like hit the island dead on. That would be scary. Uh, Alright, let's see. I finally got the hero charm. It's pretty useless. Oh, that's spoiler, so I'm not going to examine that picture. The hero charm, what could that be? I wonder. Alright, so we already opened this. There used to be a giant uh, headstone statue there, I think. Oh, maybe that was... Oh, you know what? It wasn't. It was a statue that blow air at you and you had to break it with your skull hammer. Uh, I already did it. Oh boy, this is the more complicated song to remember. <clears throat> you guys recognize that symbol right there? Hmm, the last one had Medley's instrument on it. 
double up, down, together, right. That I'm going to have a lot. I guarantee you guys. I'm going to have to look at what that is multiple times. Thankfully, I can see it on my gamepad. So here you go. The last song in the game. You learn the Wind Gods area. It's a Kokiri. It's like me. Are you the new hero? I am Fado of the Kokiri tribe. I know I appear to you as a child, but the eyes can off deceive. I'm a most esteemed sage. I've been praying here so that the power to repel evil will continue to be contained within the blade of the Master Sword. But I was attacked by Ga the evil Ganondorf, and this is what happened to me. I died. You wish to return the power to your blade, don't you? I said that really weird. Totes my goats, yo bro. In that case, look for the one who has the same instrument that I hold and teach him the song that you played. Once you do, I'm certain the holder of the instrument will feel the blood of the sages awaken within his veins. That one waker you hold was used long ago to conduct us sages when we played our songs to call upon the gods. In those days, it was always the king who conducted for us. Please, tell the king I will still play even in the next world. That's cool. I mean, I don't think I ever do that, but... Let's go see if we could tell the king of Red Lions that. So, his instruments! Hope you paid close attention to that, because this stumped me a lot as a kid. I think I was able to figure out that it was Medley's instrument, maybe. But I gotta say, especially because Medley's always playing music and it's always very clear. But I remember being able to figure this out too well. We're gonna have a lot of troubles. I got the swift sail! Cool. That's kind of a pointless selfie, but okay. <laughs> Let's got a new stage. Oh, see, I can't even tell him. If we ever ease, oh, if we ever ease poor Fado's regret, we must seek out the new sage. Nope, I guess we're not telling him. Great. What an asshole. Okay. So. Guys, I mean, there's no way, once again, to know where this instrument is. Unless, like, you know, you actually paid attention. Which, let's face it, there's a chance you didn't. <laughs> I'm not, it's not even if you didn't pay attention, but it's like, that's not even something you would think you would need to remember, right? I don't know, to me anyways, and also I like how it's sunset, that's really cool. This is Shadow of the, um, the Woods here. Oh no, it's Shadow of that place. Oh, it's so cool. Alright. Can we get bait while we're here? Ah, whatever, we'll leave it. Freaking Beetle's angry face on a ship, or I'm just gonna ignore that. <laughs> All right, so. Oh, there's music notes coming from there. Is, this, is the is the waterfall pulling for us? Yep. That sounds familiar. You no, know, I was kind of trying to decide here if I wanted to even um, go up to where the Deku tree was, but if the notes are that obvious, I might as well not do that. So we're looking for someone that plays an instrument, and there just so happens to be someone that's playing an instrument here. Does have any idea who it could possibly be? Well, actually, we don't need to go all the way down here. I mean, I tried to just swim in there, and I couldn't. What? Actually, I wonder. Can I use my Deku Leaf to get in there? Because what the thing is, you're supposed to use your grappling hook and then swing into there. But out of pure curiosity, can I do this? Oh, you can. That's funny. I did not know I could do it like that. So yeah, there's this cool, awesome little cave. That's so nice. Oh man. Oh Link, I haven't seen you in quite some time, have I? I'm surprised you were able to find me here. Hmm? You were wondering why I'm all the way down here? I'm practicing a new song for next year's ceremony, and I need privacy. It isn't any fun if everyone knows in advance what song I'll play. What? You can hear my song outside? R really? I thought the sound of the waterfall would drown it out. Yeah, it mostly did. Perhaps I should play a little more softly when I practice from now on. Please, if you don't mind, keep the fact that I'm practicing here a secret. I don't want everyone to know about it. Okay, you creepy guy. So I guess, I mean, the Zora was the ancestor of Medley. So in that case, oh, I already forget the song. I already forget it. Why, is that a conductor's baton? Link, are you a maestro? That's incredible. Are you going to conduct for me, Link? What kind of song is it? I can't wait to hear it. Please conduct. Let's see if I can remember. Nope. 
I know it's up, up, down, together, up. Oh, no, I was close. Okay, I'm looking now. Um, on my game pad here, which shows all my music. Oh, it's so hard to remember. Uh, double up, down, together, right. That is definitely the hardest song to remember in the game. The Wind Gods area. Hmm, does it go something like this? Strange. Why does it feel like I already know this song? That was like the main theme song right there. Clapping? I don't know that. That was weird. Whoa, he like drew out the ground. Link. The sacred song that you conducted for me has awakened me. I know myself now. I'm the sage of the wind temple. See? This guy is definitely more of an earth type than a wind type. It is my fate to return the power to repel the evil to your master sword. And to ease the regrets of my ancestors. Oh, Link, please, you must take me with you to the Wind Temple. Alrighty then. Oh, we're just here now. Where is he? What the heck? Oh. <laughs> I just love that so much. Can I talk to him? Was I just going to try and talk to the king? No, I want to talk to... I want to talk to dude. Why did you late? We must guide the one to the temple of the repel the evil of the mess. Yeah, you already said that about freaking what's her face. Medley. No, I wish I could talk to them. Alrighty then, let's go. Might as well. So I went yeah, I was initially gonna go up to the Deku tree and just be like, oh well, where's uh Fido? No. Where is uh oh crap, what's his name? Oh no, I'm forgetting his name all of a sudden. Uh uh, uh oh crap. Where's this guy? <laughs> but, you know, there's no point. Um, yeah. Is there someone there? Who's standing? Oh, it's just that guy. Okay, but in front of the mailbox there. I didn't recognize who that was. Hey, look, I remember which way to go without even looking at my map this time. Third time to the charm. Haha. <laughs> oh, I don't remember his name. So I guess, though, uh, the Kokiri evolved into become these Deku people. I can't remember those that they're like their tribe name. Are you serious right now? My brain is just pooping. Pooping out, man. It's being all wiggity wiggity whack and stuff. Yo, Holmes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, get the bottle. Oh, I won't reach it. Oh, there's the fishy fish. Goodbye, Mr. Fish. Oh, man. I'm gonna need rupees. Hopefully, there'll be a lot of rupees in here. I need a lot more rupees to complete this game. I guess Beetle Shop Ship is the last thing I need a lot of rupees for, though, which I guess is over another thousand. So we're kind of halfway there. Link. As was the case with Smedley, I have no doubt that Makar. Makar! That dang it! The Makar, too, has some special role to play in these events. D discovering that role is your duty. I'm certain that by cooperating, the two of you can overcome the dangers and pitfalls of this temple. Well, at least he's not going to explain the same thing you do with me and Medley, so that's always great. So, yeah, this is a new Medley, which isn't as interesting. I think he walks even slower. Oh, good lord. <laughs> in the original game, I always try to position myself in front of these tablets in a way you would be able to see in the background, much like you can right here, so that you'd be able to do it a lot easier. <laughs> do it. Look at the cherries on his stick. How do you even hold this dude? It's unfortunate that these guys were like a few years longer and he, they would evolve to the point where they can't even hold these instruments anymore. They've essentially evolved to many trees. Wind Temple. Once again, feels like that should be reversed. This should totally be the Earth Temple. Especially when you see what the inside of this place looks like. <laughs> He's dancing. He's like, yeah, let's go. This is going to be fun, right? We're going to an amusement park. Uh huh. Look at this place. I forgot the music was here. Did this not just scream Earth Temple to you? This isn't the Wind Temple. The last temple should have been the Wind Temple. Uh, anyways, in the next episode, 
we are going to start the Wind Temple. Mm, stupid. If you guys enjoyed, talk to you guys next time. Bye-bye.